What is good, y'all? It's your boy, Mixtape Mob. If you are rocking with this content, go ahead and smash that like button up for your boy. And please subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. But today, I'm going to hit y'all with my thoughts on this new project from Crime Apple and Big Ghost LTD entitled Bosico. This North Jersey MC of Colombian descent has been pumping out a plethora of very solid projects annually for years now. As a result, Crime Apple has been one of the more slept on and dependable underground artists since about 2018. But this new project, Basuka, is his third drop so far in 2024. And at the start of the year, he had released El Leon with DJ Preservation. And that was followed up by Let Him Cook. But now he has rejoined forces with the ultra consistent Big Ghost uh, to do their follow up to their 2018 project entitled uh, Our Guardiente. Buster Guts contains 13 songs lasting approximately 40 minutes. But with that being said, let me go ahead and just hit y'all with that track by track breakdown. The opener introduction is a skit with a reporter speaking on a new form of cocaine. Uh, Basica that is being sold and smoked in Colombian crack houses so it's just letting you know the project is going to have that blow like theme. The first actual song Laugh now has a mixture of a syrupy sax and these shimmering keys. It's really an elegant beat. The sax and the key combo was dope. But on this one Crime Apple was giving us some reflection and fly talk. Track 3 Re-Rock uh, has this definitive big ghost type beat that Feels like it was tailor-made for Griselda. Now, Crime Apple was going in over this rugged instrumental, uh, but his flow here has a little bit of a bop. One witty line from Crime Apple was, how could I not be cracked? I swam up my father's balls while he inhaled rocks. Chilling imagery indeed. After this is 5,000 degrees, which has a crisp atmospheric beat. This slightly channeled uh, old school cash money vibes very slightly that is, but it was a different sound altogether that made things interesting. Track 5 is Chemical Imbalances, and it has one of my favorite instrumentals. There's a beat shift, the first has radiant keys, while the second has a jazzy rhythm uh, as a whole. Uh, dope boom bap on display. Next is Trust Issues of Few, and it has a suspenseful uh, backdrop that uses the same sample uh, that you may remember on Raekwon's Sonny's Missing, uh, produced by Pete Rock. That was from that education of Sonny Carson movie. Crime Apple states, I don't trust dudes no further than I could shoot them. Came to get it not. I'm tying up all loose ends. And every new album feels like salt in an open wound. Could turn out your lights if you really step in, get your shoes. Right after is Pretty Girl, Who Can Rap? And it is backed by this ultra fly um, triumphant loop that sounds right out of a Black exploitation flick. Here, Crime is speaking on all the female rappers that he would get with. So you do have clever wordplay, some sex bars, uh, and a little bit of disrespect. But as a whole, uh, I dug the Mackish tone uh, to this track. It's very suave. The subsequent song, uh, Higher Learning, uh, is a return to that dirtier boom bap aesthetic. And Crime is reflecting on the past uh, when he would flood college campuses uh, with that work giving students that higher learning. Crime vividly recalls, for the cash I knew exactly what to measure. When the measures got drastic, I still recall when my endeavors weren't scholastic. In college, I had white boys licking on that plastic. So this was a darker, uh, grimier track uh, where he was in his Coke talk bag heavy. There's also a grim, moody vibe on the following song, Smoke Signal. Uh, here Crime is doing mad braggadocia, reminding cats that their tapes don't slap like his. Crime states, Crime and Ghost, New Dope. To think I used to care if they would post me on Two Dope. Now, Two Dope here is referring to that Two Dope Boys blog. There was some clever wordplay, and I dug the uh, following scheme with Nas and Foxy. Man, I've been silent for lots of years. Why am I surprised? Gotta figure they even shot sincere. Shit, everybody dropping. It does not compare. I'd be like, ooh, nah, nah. I wish I had Foxy's ears. So it's super disrespectful, but clever at the same time. The next song, The Tropicana, uh, has a glamorous loop that is very fitting for the title. And some bars that jumped out were, I eat watercress, asparagus, apricot, your bitch rapping, hands around my dick, you just rap a lot. Track 11, uh, Las Trompetas, has these uh, funky trumpets that bring a 
playful vibe to the record. It's also an unorthodox beat. Uh, he's doing some fly boasting. And uh, talking about all the producers that have bigged him up and co-signed him as being a dope artist, like The Alchemist, Mad Lib, Primo, Muggs, and even Dr. Dre. So in Crime Apple's eyes, only Kanye is left. Second to last track is Motorcycle Sicario School, and it is a posse cut uh, with TF, RLX, and Mickey Diamond. Set to a quirky, psychedelic beat, but I have to say Crime Apple and Mickey Diamond had the best verses. And this project comes to a close with Die Later, and it has a mafioso flair. But on this one, Crime is exposing those who get all of their coke talk from watching movies about Pablo Escobar, and uh, they've seen Cocaine Cowboys too many times. So overall, I'm gonna give this project a rating of four mics. Now, out of his three releases so far this year, this will likely have the most replay value for me, uh, and that's probably because there's more of a drum presence and more variety to the production. I also think it's a worthy follow-up uh, to their 2018 project. Uh, I'd say it's just a more a polished and updated version of that album. Which proves that after all these years, uh, Crime and Big Ghost still have this chemistry and they both have evolved uh, in their respective crafts over time. Uh, favorite tracks include Re-Rock, Chemical Imbalances, Pretty Girl Who Can Rap, Higher Learning, Smoke Signal, Las Chapetas, and Die Later. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section. It's your boy Mix Tate Moff. I'm signing out. As always, it's peace and blessings. Crime Apple, Big Ghost, Bazooka, one.